welcome Gemini's I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for um, my excuses for the lateness uh, um, my excuses for the lateness all right Gemini's 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 deceptiveness 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 this month is a month of deceptiveness on the work floor number seven the seven of swords uh, fertility um so be aware of this uh, um it shows the energy that is going to be coming up for a lot of you gemini's on the work floor it is happening where we see strength we see justice we see the star in reverse and an aquarian gemini or libran uh so you women some sort of a uh deceptive play um that is going to be coming out but um as you get out of this month it is going to be ending um i see multiple opportunities is going to be coming up for a lot of you so again um be aware especially women 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 um between the ages of 18 and 45 i see that justice came down on this person and this person is looking as an aquarian a gemini or a liberan so um, as we go to the extended of this reading, we will find out who is this person. But justice came up on this person. Let's hope uh, that it is not you guys, um, because this person is not going to be successful. So let's hope that it's not you, Gemini women. This is a person between the age of 18 and 45. They have realized what this person have done and how this person was controlling a situation. Okay. If you notice, uh, um, the three, the two energies that is not uh, um, major arcana. So you Gemini's are working with some real strong major arcana, real powerful major arcana. Okay, but in this month you will receive some sort of an opportunity, and that is good, Gemini's. And I see that the opportunities could be coming in because they have realized uh, what an um, in. Um, a dishonest play that was played against you guys. So, if you have a, um, a legal problems where you took your um, client or you took your boss to court and that sort of a thing, I see truths is going to be coming in because they are going to be realizing the dishonesty of what is happening and transpiring. And I am seeing that uh, um, you're going to be. Uh, um, you know, coming out of this month, uh, um, ending some sort of a dishonest situation that was transpiring. So Gemini, this looks good. Um, there's no need and uh, no reason to worry about what is transpiring because what we realize is that in this month, you're going to be finding the strength in the first week. So the first week is a week of strength. Um, you have gone through this first week last week and you realize that you needed a whole lot of inner strength in order to deal with uh, situations okay and you're going to be fine in the situation now the number for this month is going to be seven nine eight seven nine eight so the number for this month is going to be seven nine eight so 13 and 4 is uh, um the ending but a new beginning the ending of the negative and a new beginning of a positive direction and that is what you're leaving this month with okay so these are good um powerful energies please be aware of what is going to be coming in in this month so when we look at the energy of strength the energy of strength in the first week is about finding inner um inner strength to deal with some sort of issues and problem you have uh, acknowledged that there was some sort of a uh, um uh, challenges chaoses uh, um, on um, dishonest play that was happening around you on the work floor. And if you notice the, um, the energy of the strength is that you're blowing this up, okay? So this situation that you found out in December, coming in January, you decide I'm ending it. I'm ending it. The first week is not leaving before I end this. This is not moving on um, with me in this year you have seen it, you are recognize it. And in the first week, you're going to be setting and blowing this up and making sure if you notice, um, it's like um, some sort of a bomb uh, coming out of a, um, 
a um the ground or um this is is, is like an unplough um the universe because everything is now falling in place people are finding out p the network the group of people that was creating this um or the deceptiveness now that could be coming up in sales it could be coming up in products stocks and that sort of a thing um the produce um um the the the, the well is it's like the well the well of the deceitfulness is now being blown up. So that is what you should realize that you Geminis are going to be blowing up some sort of a deceit, uh, some sort of a chaos, some sort of a dishonest play that was uh, going on. You Gemini is going to get to the bottom of it and end it, end it, end it, end it in the first week. And this is going to be good. Justice is in the reverse for you, Geminis, whatever that was happening and transpiring. We have the energy of justice in re reverse. And it is because of uh, things that was uh, on dishonest, the dishonesty that created from this. Um, now it is opening up. Now people are recognizing because you make sure that the first week that this is being blown up. And now you're recognizing that people who were supposed to be clean and people who were supposed to be really creating, um, you know, positive things for other people around you is not the ones who are doing that. You realize that manager, supervisor and that sort of a thing were not, um, you know, looking at their jobs. We're not working and having the experience they should have to be in their position. And now you're spitting over and turning over leaves, spitting over, showing up, turning over leaf, recognizing, showing up and letting people understand what was happening and what was transpiring. Okay. And, 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 and this is something that is going to be the central point for the month that you make sure that people come from outside to investigate whatever is happening in the, in the, in the department or in the company, because there is just some serious issue that is going on. So I see that you Geminis are going to be focused and really on point and really, um, and, um, you know, recognizing what you need to do. And you're going to be doing this in the correct form because you're going to be picking up and making sure that everything is being replaced. So, and uh, the, the, the process is going to be rewritten um, so that this year um, everything can flow good because you're in a time, a time where you're in is uncertainty in this time. This time is a time of uncertainty and you only want the people with integrity um, to move forward with. And I see that in the third week, you're going to be rebalancing out whatever that was transpiring. A lot of you um, young people between the age of 18 and 45, uh, you could be um, faced with some serious issue when it comes on to personnel officer, when it comes on to legal matters. Um, is it that you are a notary person? They're, they could be picking you up and seeing that you have let certain things go by. It could be personnel officer. It could be the manager and supervisor of a department. They're going to be coming down hard on you guys uh, because of something that you should have uh, um, followed up on and it would have, have gone so far. So what we're seeing is that they're looking at you. They're start trying to find out uh, um, who have not done their jobs properly, who uh, was in the position to stop this before it gets out of on who and they're going to be looking at some of you ladies. It doesn't have to be you. It could be an Aquarian or a Libran. So in order to find out who this person is and what was happening and transpiring and what they, how do they play a role in this deceptiveness that was going on, you have to um, follow us to the other side. Remember, this is a timeless reading. Whenever you pick it up, it has a four weeks function. In this four weeks, it is telling you what is going to be coming up in this four weeks. And um, whatever question you have and this reading comes up in your timeline, um, this is going to be advising you of what is going to be coming up in the four weeks. Okay, so 
when we move along and what we're looking at is that uh, on top of you you're going to be receiving if you're looking for jobs opportunities uh, freelance work and that sort of a thing creativity it is going to be coming in okay it is definitely going to be coming in use this number seven o'clock nine o'clock eight o'clock to make appointments if you're applying for a job um these are the time you should set it these are the time that is going to be frequency flowing in your energy okay um and this is going to be good so what has been happening and transpiring is that uh, the eight of cups is about the end the end to, to some unsavory situation that was happening and transpired is as if uh, you decided we are moving in a new year and we're going to be making the right choices and creating new process uh, in order for um, the um, assured profit to be created. And I see a whole lot of you are going to be really cleaning up, especially in the first week. The number nine energy is you standing your ground, cleaning up a lot of work, but yet still you're going to be removing and rooting out the weeds, the horrible weeds that has been blocking um, this company or this business from moving forward. So some of you, it has to do with your company. Some of you, it has to do with your business. Some of you, it has to do with some sort of a block that was created for you. So I see you're blowing up and exposing. I see you, Geminis, are going to be exposing some sort of an unsavory situation that was going on. So your foundation and what you're ending the month with is a transition. So you're making a whole lot of changes. And the changes that you're making is removing the unsavory people and situation process that wasn't working that sort of a situation opening up balancing out opening up uh, doors uh, um creating stability in your business you know getting the right people on board and um, getting the right people in the right team but um dissolving whatever unsavorable behavior that was being created by other people and said, listen, um, you want to be on my team? You want to get on my team? This is how we're going to be working in a really desirable way. And I see that this is going to be good for you. So Gemini, I love this. I love this. I love this. I love you, Geminis. You Geminis are always, uh, um, you know, you know, secretly investigating what is happening, what is transpiring. Um, this is going to be good for you, Gemini's. We can see that this energy is going to be profiting you a lot. I see um, wonderful alignment of energy where you're pulling out the um, whatever um, little trickery that people were doing. You, Gemini's, have found out what they were doing. And it's going to be releasing and resolving this situation in a really positive way. But you, Geminis, are going to be making sure that people are aware and aligned with what to do in this year, especially if you are a supervisor, if you are a manager, if you are someone who works in a team, run a team, you are going to be making sure that the process is properly and it's not going to be as if it was before. So a lot of you who gets promoted in the month of December is coming in your position and is creating and making these changes and seeing where things were going wrong. Or some of you could just realize that, oh, that person has gone. So now I know exactly what was going wrong. Let me stand up and get in this and create and clear up um, this situation because I know this person was running the department in a correct way. So this is going to be good because a lot of you are going to be it's taking a step and it's going to be standing and it's going to be creating new um, possibility, new positive possibilities in your world. And this is going to be creating a rippling effect where it's going to be springing you, giving you some sort of a lead way moving forward in this company or um, um, your business because um, you are realizing what was being um, blocked and who was creating these situation and the horrible deceptive play that was transpiring is going to be coming to light and you're going to be recognizing how powerful 
you have, that the skills and knowledge that you have is bringing you and opening up new doors of opportunities. So go for it, and I'll see you on the other side. If not, namaste.